Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Right, what's up everyone and welcome back to some more pain and suffering. Welcome to the Eliminator everyone. <laughs> it's been a little while since I've played the Eliminator. I feel like every single time I start one of these videos it's always the same thing. It's been a while since I've played the, Elimin the Eliminator. Um, but it has been and it always will be because of the fact that I just don't play it as often. I feel like if I did play it as often as I used to back in the day, I think I would be a much better player at this game. But as of right now, I don't think I'm very good at it. Which I feel like is kind of entertaining to watch. Uh, I don't know. That's what I think anyway. Regardless. Let's pick the Nissan. Let's go in and see what happens. Uh, I'm gonna spawn here. The the usual the usual spot. Because it kinda it kinda is the center of the map, that's why. I love spawning there. Anyway, let's try it out. Like I said, since it's been a while, I feel like I kinda wanna just try and spawn somewhere nice and try to see if I can get some sort of a a drop here. Come on, game. Give me a nice level 5, level 6 drop straight off the bat. I can start going. There's no drops here. Um, <laughs> I was going to say, I just want to get a nice level 5, level 6 to start eliminating people. Left, right, and center. I just want to just want to go and, and eliminate people. Okay, there's one to my left, but it's a little out of the way. I'll take it. I will definitely take it. Right. Imagine now. This guy is just a straight up cheater. Because I haven't played in a while, I don't know what the cheating situation is like in this game. Are people still like cheating? Or what? What's the, what's the deal here? If you have seen some of my previous videos, you would have seen that I have run across some cheaters. Sometimes. So, I don't know if that situation has been... Oh God. If that situation has been resolved or not, or what, what the deal is. Like, have they banned enough cheaters now where just there aren't that many, or what's the deal here? I don't really know. I really, really couldn't tell you. Hopefully, we don't run into any of them. I mean, it would make it for really good content if I do, but it'd still be very, very annoying to run into cheaters. So hopefully, that doesn't really happen. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. We got a, an alright drop at the start. I was definitely expecting something worse, but we're now on level 5 already. Um, I'm gonna go back towards the center of the map here. Or the center of the zone. This guy's kind of just following me around. Not the best of cards here to have. Um. Is it in the direction that I'm pointing? Yes, it is. I was kind of south of the zone and I... I kind of expected it to be this way. Okay, try and avoid that. That was kind of clean. This guy has a horrific, horrific top speed. I'm pretty sure that Nissan, level 1 Nissan, has a higher top speed than this. I think it just takes a while to get there, but this thing has a very crappy top speed. So I need to try and be careful as well. There's also going to be a lot of rocks and things in the way here, so. There you go, try and avoid as much of that as possible. And just like that, we will be in a level 6 car. Okay, not, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. Not too bad. A lot of little arrows behind me, so I might just turn around and go towards them. Still does the thing where okay, this is a much better Porsche though, much much better Porsche. Completely different, but it's much better. I think one guy just got eliminated. Ooh, Audi RS6. That is 
That is a good one. As much as I like the R6, I don't, I don't really know what its chances are against this. It is incredibly, incredibly OP. But this 959 is also super, super good. I mean, this car deserves to be at, at level 6. That Audi does not deserve to be at level 2. It deserves to be mu uh, much higher. I'm trying to be kind of careful here. He's on a path, so he's going to catch up to me a little bit here. I'm just kind of off-roading. So I think he will overtake me at some point here. Well, maybe not. Yeah, that thing is way too fast. Look how fast it is! Was he messed up here, though? Oh! <laughs> he was so confident he was gonna win. Oh, I hate that man. Oh. <laughs> right into the tree. Oh, I know how it feels. I know exactly how that feels. Oh, that sucks. That really does suck. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I just ate that tree so hard. <laughs> Alright. I can see a bunch of people already in level 10 cars, so it's not... It's not fun. But... What I want to do is I want to try and see if I can position myself in a way where I can actually use this car's potential, because this thing off-road is ass. So if I can try to keep this thing as much on the actual road itself, like on the asphalt, as much as I can do that, then, uh, then I, I, sh I, I should really mind driving this thing. Is this guy coming towards the highway? He is coming towards the highway. What's the zone looking like? I don't know what car he just got, but I want to try and race him. Oh no. It. We're off roading. Let's go. I don't know how this is gonna work, but come on, Ferrari. <laughs> Somehow, some way, do something good. Oh, this is gonna be so bad. Hope for the best. Not bad. So. <laughs> In the riverbed, come on. Jesus. I don't know how I managed to do that, but I did. Alright, up here now. Trying to avoid all that area, because that is crap. He's struggling as well. In the AMG, but that thing has all-wheel drive. I kind of scattered the route a little bit. I realized what the, the the size of the riverbed are and everything. Like, just look terrible. So, had to try and avoid that as much as I possibly could. Somehow, though, I made it. I made it through the the, the trees pretty pretty nicely, though. All right. What's our level eight car? Do something good. Don't be don't be bad, please. I'll take it. I'll take the mercy. So I can see what's going on. Especially when it's nighttime, it's so hard to actually see what's going on in this game. Right. Come on. I want to race whoever's there. I, can't, I don't know what car he's driving. There's another guy here, he also finished. Do I cheese it? I'm gonna cheese it. Yeah. We both did the same thing. See the trees. 
what the tractor is. Is he gonna eat tree? He's not gonna eat tree. Oh, come on. I bounced from one tree to another. Seriously. I've lost it. I have lost this one. That is stupid. Yeah, I mean, trees just ruin everything, don't they? Nothing I could really do there. I really bounce from one tree to another, like... Some of the zones that they give us are so shit in this. So bad. I mean, it's kind of... I was gonna say karma, but it's not really karma, because I didn't really crash into that guy or anything like that. It's just the way it all worked out was... I won because of a tree, and then I lost because of a tree. It's just, uh... It's just kind of funny. Let's go again. Let's try again, at least. Let's see what we can do here. Hopefully, this time around, we can try and uh, progress a little quicker through the cars. And uh, the zone isn't as bad. I don't want to race in trees. <laughs> That's the one thing about this game, right? That's the one thing about like Forza Horizon 4 that I kind of liked. Is that it was a little bit more open. In certain areas, but the, the areas where it wasn't open, like, you were kind of forced to use the, the roads themselves. So I kind of wish that in this game, they made it so bad to off-road in some of the cars that you should kind of be forced to use the roads themselves. Some some of the people watching the video right now are definitely going to agree with me, and they would have definitely wanted the roads to be used a lot more in the Eliminator. It would make a lot more sense, and would make it a little bit more fun. But, I mean, obviously... That's not really the case. You just have whatever car you want. Like me and my Lamborghini trying to go off-road versus that aerial nomad. I mean, it kind of went as expected. But it's still a little annoying. Um, absolutely zero drops, by the way. There's one really far away that way. Which I don't know if I can be bothered to go that way. Especially since I turn this way now. So I'm going to go towards the stadium. See if along the way maybe I can spot a drop somewhere. And then try and take it. So far, I see nothing. I see one really far that way as well. I feel like you guys watching the video are not going to be able to see these as clearly as I can. Even if the video is in 4K. I feel like it's just hard to spot them. I'm going straight for one right now, so we'll see. If I can get to it in time, or someone else is going to take it. It is far. I think we should be good. I don't see anybody on the minimap, but again, that's it's kind of random though. If the game actually wants to show people on the minimap or not, uh, that'd be nice. Cool. Escort Mark One is actually quite quite a decent car. It's not too bad of a level two. What's this video? One over here. Come on, mate. <laughs> well, he's driving the wrong way, but apart from that, uh, he might absolutely demolish me. I need, I need, this is as big of a head start as I can possibly get. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is just gonna be dumb. If I could take this guy's Nomad off him, this would be... Sensational. Again, another car with a crappy top speed, just like the the dessert fire. The thing is that I'm gonna avoid those rocks completely. I think. Ah, oh, it's so bad off road as well. Is he avoiding the rocks, or what's what's the deal with him? He's gonna eat some rocks, and he he has to. He is absolutely flying. He's missed all the rocks. He has missed all the rocks. I am now in second place. I might genuinely lose this. Unless he somehow misses this entire thing completely. He crashed. Oh, the spam of the good luck. And then him losing. Oh god, that hurts. Oh no. Oh, imagine. Imagine uh, people that emote at the end of races after they've after they think that they've won. 
oh, it's it's the best thing ever. And then they end up losing. It just, oh, god, that was just phenomenal. Come on, Nomad. X5 was very good, though. So good, in fact, that I actually won with it before. Thing is, though, I'm in a Nomad. He is stronger than me, though, so I think all these, like, bushes and things don't really slow him down as much as me. However, I do have more power. I think I do have more grip. And obviously I'm like 5 billion kilos lighter than him. But this is a good area to climb the mountain though. This is really, really good. Because this bit only goes up like a tiny bit. <gasps> rocks! Did he eat the rocks? He didn't eat the rocks. I'm also not all the drive, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I'm just rearable drive. But I do have really good tires for this. But I was going to say, this is a really good area to climb up because it kind of goes up not too steep, if that makes sense. It's just nice and smooth driving up here. So with just a little bit of throttle control, you can make it up without sliding or slipping or, or anything crazy. He is keeping up with me though. Okay, cool. That's a good win. We're already on level 7. I don't like that I've been brought up to the top of the mountain, though. Because racing on top of the mountain, if you've ever watched the videos or if you've ever done it yourself, it is horrific. Terrible place to race. So we'll see. It's not going to end up at, at the top of the mountain, though, the zone. I don't think so. Because, like, I mean, look at it. It's, like, tiny up here. Uh, should I just wait? I think I might just wait up here. I'm going to wait just until the zone touches, and then I'm going to go back down the, down the mountain again. I just kind of want to see whereabouts should I really be positioning myself to go, if that makes sense. So for right now, I need to kind of go down that way. That is really the way I should be facing. Arena shrinking. Arena. The rest of the zone is pretty much down there, so I need to now wait for this thing to touch, and then I'll I'll slowly go back down again because I don't. There's nobody up here with me, so I think I was the only person somehow being sent up here. <laughs> there's no other people up here, so I need to try and just kind of be careful, um, and then just make my way down slowly. But I need to see where the next zone is going to be because if it's going to be like here, I'm going to try and approach it from a specific angle. Alright, just, just give it a little bit of a wait, let's see what happens, come on, touch, alright, now it's about to touch, let's have a look at the zone, uh, I'm gonna say it's gonna be maybe somewhere down here, <laughs> okay, that was spot on, that was spot on with my, uh, with my guess, Still no arrows, so I can't see a single person. There's some arrows. I'm gonna try and position myself kind of behind them, if that makes sense. We're all kind of going to the same place. What is this guy doing? What? What was that guy doing? That was very odd. Unless he's cheating. <laughs> which, which would be hilarious. But it would also be very, very stupid. 
And this thing actually catch some speed. Jesus Christ, why am I being slowed down by everything? He's caught up to me already. What is he driving? Oh, it's an Audi. Unlucky, mate. Game's the game. Game is the game. This is how it's being played. Ah! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! He <laughs> landed on his wheels! No f***ing way to- <laughs> No, that was sick. I don't even care that I lost that one. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, what the f- oh. <laughs> What just happened? Oh my god. That was- that was perfect. That was honestly perfect. This whole- video is just karma this video is the definition of karma that was mad the guy gloating at the start and then I ended up beating him because he crashed oh my god and then me doing that that was amazing oh uh, I'm not even mad man that is just so funny <laughs> I might just genuinely leave it there that was just way too jokes that was way too funny Oh man, try, I'll try one more. I'll try one more time, just for a laugh. But that this this video is unreal. I don't even care that I'm not winning. I feel like people are gonna enjoy this video. It's just entertaining to watch. I, man, it's entertaining for me to play because of just what is going on. It's just baffling. It's so funny though. I I genuinely love it. <laughs> I genuinely love it. It's so good. Generally, one of the funnest recordings of the Eliminator that I've done. It, it was just way too jokes. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Seriously, because I enjoyed making it. It was just way too funny. But both of the games that I played, like, they were just way too good. Thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you want to see more videos like this on the channel, then please subscribe. Like this video if you enjoyed it. And I guess I'll see you guys later. I'm down to do some more Eliminator videos if they're just like this. Because I don't mind them like this. I don't care if I lose, but if it's just a funny game to play, I don't mind it. Okay? Because I've done my time on the Eliminator where I've just gone for the win constantly. Or I've gone for... Uh, just getting as many eliminations as possible and that was good and all and being very very competitive but now playing it like this it's just honestly hilarious so if i get more games like this then uh, i'm more than happy to make more videos like this but for now that's pretty much it thank you for watching everyone and i'll see you guys later goodbye